Oh, Lord have mercy, another coon. So, y'all, I'm sitting out in Greenville, North Carolina. Sunny day today. And I'm sitting here waiting. Some of my truck drivers know about this. I'm waiting for my clock to reset. Get these 10 hours over with. But I figured I would come in here and deal with Terry Crews. Oh, ignorant, coon-ass Terry Crews. And the problem with his argument for equality. Now, Terry Crews put this out. Says, defeating white supremacy without white people creates black supremacy. Equality is the truth. Like it or not, we are all in this together. Now, some people struggle with understanding how much of a poor argument equality is without being put on equal footing first. I'm going to go read y'all out. Some people is calling his ass out, of course. And it says here, any black person who calls me a coon or an Uncle Tom, he knew I was coming. <laughs> For promoting equality is a black supremacist because they have determined who's black and who's not. Now, I'm going to try to break this equality thing down as simple as, simple as I can. I'm going to be using simple mathematics. Some black people will argue that they struggle with math. Math is trash. Well, one thing black people don't seem to struggle with is counting money. So I'll do, uh, uh, I'll put it in a monetary uh, format and thus will make it easier to understand. The question would be, how can one be equal to somebody else who has a million dollars? We'll start with a million, right? Let's say you got a million dollars, I got a hundred dollars, and the fact that you have that million dollars, you've, you know, enslaved, raped, pillaged, you know, you, you got your million dollars, uh, you know, however the fuck you went out here and got it savagely. I got my hundred dollars. And all of a sudden, I come telling you that we equal. And the other people who may only have a hundred dollars are sitting here arguing for the fact that now you are equal just based on the verbiage you're equal now to the person with the million dollars because they said you were equal. The problem is they have a million dollars. You have one hundred dollars until they give you a million dollars until you are granted a million dollars. There can be no equality. Now, to me, this is a, a very simple, you know, a simple argument here. There is no such thing as equality without black people getting restitution. We're calling it uh, uh, reparations. Without that, there is no equality. So then the question would be, Terry Crews, what the fuck are you talking about? Coons like Terry Crews are into this whole, well, you know, uh, we want to be equal with white people. There can be no equality without undoing what has already been done. You cannot be equal. You can start the game at zero while the other team is up uh, 460 points. But you can't be equal like that. You're in the hole. you in the negative. Equal is everybody starting at zero or everybody starting at one million. That's equal. And thus, you cannot reach equality by just simply saying, oh, well, we all equal now. We all in this together. No, we're not. Our argument is that we are in the negative. They got a million, we got a hundred. I mean, however you look at it, there's nothing equal about that. And that's before we even get into uh, the legal aspect of this thing. 
That's even before that. We just dealing with money. We dealing with the fact that we had Black Wall Streets with an S. Some of y'all just think it happened in Tulsa. No, it was Black Wall Streets all over the country. They burned them down. Well, burned a lot of them down. Coons like Terry Crews, who were seeking equality, sold the other ones out. Because they would rather give their money to the white man and his mama. See, Terry Crews and his mentality has been a plague on the black community historically. We can't be equal by you just saying, okay, well, now that I got the game rigged, I got the game set up, I made all the laws, I made all the rules, well, now you can come in here and hang out with me. That's not equal. We cannot make, uh, 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 you know, this system be so-called equal to us black people because this system will not bring us about the negative. They won't deal with the redlining. They won't deal with the disenfranchisement. In a lot of ways, the businesses, you have to have money to create businesses. They're not giving us free business grants. Like They're not doing that. And thus, we cannot be equal. It's not possible for us to be equal. I don't want equality that's not my argument I don't want people to get it confused to where you know these people these black people with big platforms they're not the voice of all of us don't get that confused Terry Crews is, is a coon it's been proven that he's a coward ass coon when he was letting some white man play with his dick so called against his will you a coward you a bitch ass motherfucking nigga and thus you can't speak for me because you would be talking about some goddamn equality. That's not what we're talking about. We're not talking about equality. Malcolm X gave the analogy of, you know, a knife being stabbed or, you know, stabbed in the back of black people. And they pulling the knife halfway out talking about healing. That wound healing. When these motherfuckers won't even acknowledge the knife was there, they won't even acknowledge the fact that we down. They got millions and millions and billions and billions and own all the businesses and we down. They won't even acknowledge that. You can't heal me by telling me all of a sudden we equal when I know damn well that 400 and goddamn over 450 years says that we're not equal. You're not going to Jedi mind trick me, nor will the coons like Terry Crews come out here and make me feel as though that I'm in the wrong. Because I don't want equality. Mm. But that's all the fuck I wanted to say, man. It's been a whole lot of shit going on. I'll be making, you know, I'll be making several... Doing some commentary today as I'm driving on the road. I'll be doing some commentary, but I just want y'all to understand that Terry Crews don't speak for me. No one does. I haven't heard anybody speaking for me. I speak for my fucking self. And any black person who's talking about equality without framing what that means or what that would be for us to be equal is not for them just to say, oh, well, now y'all equal. I'm in the hole, bitch. Bring me up out of the motherfucking hole. If you had a million, us being equal would be me being at a million. If you had a billion, us being equal would be me being at a billion. You got five billion, you give me two and a half billion. Now we both got two and a half, that's equal. And that's the only way. The ideology of equality has clouded black people's visions, clouded our minds for a long time. And it's time to be very clear where you stand about so-called equality.
Y'all like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Links to follow me on social media in the description box. Black first, second, and third. And we not falling for the illusion of so-called equality over here. Shout out to Team Rob. Y'all already know what the fuck it is. I'm out.